The customer of Machine One wants employee Bart Simpson to have access to Turk Cloud. The employee is to be able to monitor and operate Machine One. To enable Bart Simpson as a user, Homer Simpson switches from the configuration mode to the administration mode and selects user administration. So far, Homer Simpson is the only user to be an administrator. So that Bart Simpson can obtain access to the Turk Cloud portal, Homer Simpson must create a user account for him. He creates the new user by clicking on Create User and enters the desired username and email address, the default language, and the time zone of the user. In the following, he can assign various rights to the new user, Bart Simpson. As Bart Simpson is an employee of End Customer 1, he only receives rights for the project End Customer 1. If the company Machine Builder has several customers, Homer Simpson, as he is the administrator, would see all customers and the associated projects, while Bart Simpson would only see the project in Customer 1, that is, the project for the company he works for. Homer Simpson now specifies which rights Bart receives in the project in Customer 1. Bart may view only the gateways and dashboards but no reports or alarms. He only has the right for the display mode. This means that he can't change the configuration, but can only view and operate the created gateways and dashboards. The user Bart Simpson has been created. He has received a welcome email, including his access data. Bart must now click a link that is provided via email and create a password so that he can gain access to his account. Now he can log in using his access data. He sees the gateways and dashboards. As he has read and also write access, he can not only monitor, he can also control the machine. However, he cannot switch to the configuration or administration mode. That is, he cannot edit anything on the dashboard, gateways, alarm, etc.